What's going on guys? I'm Brown Gaddy and this is Brown Gaddy Outdoors. We're out here at Oregon Inlet as you can see. We've got the Coast Guard station over there and we got the boats over here. And today we're going to be trying for a swordfish and seeing if we can catch one. So uh, yeah, stay tuned. swordfish fillets we have the guys at Oregon Inlet Fishing Center clean them for us big thanks to them for doing that and we got some nature seasoning season blend by Morton 
And we have some Laurie's lemon pepper here, um, a gallon plastic bag, and we got our swordfish fillets, and we're gonna get to cooking them. All right, guys, so the first thing we're gonna do is grab our plastic bag, and we're gonna get our Laurie's lemon pepper, open that up, and just put a little bit to the bag, about that much. Just enough to where we can put the swordfish fillets in. Did you? Like that. I'm gonna put all three of them in. Just like this. And close the bag. Just like this. And cover the fillets. And you're just gonna let them sit for about 15 minutes and marinate them. All right guys, so we're gonna put our swordfish steaks that have been marinated for about 15 minutes. So we're just gonna put them onto the grill now. Put the first one put on. Next one on. And the last one on it goes just like that. Cooking swordfish. Just close the grill now and cook it. And just like any other fish, you're going to want to get like the inside of the fish to about 145 degrees. And once it gets to that, you're pretty much done. All right, guys, so we're going to check the temperature on these guys. They need to be 145 degrees inside. This one's ready. This one's almost ready. And this last one's ready. So we're gonna go ahead and get these two off. And we're just gonna put them under there for now. And we can check this one again, see so if it's gotten there yet. And now it's ready. I'm gonna put that guy on and we'll see you guys in the kitchen. All right guys, here they are. The three swordfish steaks. All right guys, so we got our swordfish steak and we got some Spanish rice here. And I'm just gonna try some of the swordfish. So just take off a little bit. It tastes really good. Um, it's the first time that I've ever cooked swordfish. So that's pretty cool that I cooked it good the first time. I didn't burn it or undercook it. That's going to be my swordfish catch, clean, and cook, guys. Um, if you enjoyed, make sure to like. And if you aren't already, make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.